Dudes, welcome to the channel. I'm Chuck. Do you fucking see that? I'm John. This is Rise of the Ronin. Oh my god. I bought that game. We are going to play it on my channel. Right now. Oh, ghost. I, I can't even speak properly. My goodness. That then just loops, I guess. Okay. Understood. What options do we have? Camera settings, controls, camera, language and audio, visuals, license. Fuck it. I'll do it later. New game. Difficulty. Dawn, dusk, twilight. For those who want to enjoy the action, you can change the difficulty setting. For those who want to enjoy the story, action. Confident in their skills. We want normal. I suck at games. Normal. Rest of the Rune is a fictional story. No. Does that mean on YouTube I need to pick I need to pick um no for for AI real something? Ago, Japan was unified under the Tokugawa Shogun. Closed its doors to the rest of the world, and for a time the island nation prospered. Oh. Oh. Despite its apparent tranquility, conflict brewed beneath the surface. Oh my god, guys. Games are so immersive. I mean, like the, 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 the graphics. Sites. In public, they were loyal. The coals of discontent were slowly being fanned towards conflagration. Deep in the mountains of Kurosu, weapons were secretly forged in preparation for rebellion. I guess there will be blood. The Shogun's forces got wind of the plan and took terrible and bloody reprisals. That in case they did not count on another type of weapon being forged in Kurosu. Warriors known as the Veiled Edge. Skilled in both subterfuge in the way of the sword, these nameless assassins were unmatched in their abilities. Under the tutelage of a master, the Blade, they honed their skills in pairs called Blade Twins. Separately, formidable. Together, unstoppable. Blade twins are forever tied together by the bonds of fate. Character creation. Here we go again, guys. We just did this for Dragon's Dogma. By changing your body, we'll delete the current appearance profile. Yes. So I can be a woman or a man. We're going to take the man. We are going to leave everything the fuck the same. Look at all this. Do you see all these options? I don't care. Oh, this is my name. I do care about that. You know why? Because we are going to be... Wait. We're going to be 
John John. Now what? Close. Okay. Apply appearance. What do I have to do here? Details back, back. Input code, save temporary data, load temporary data, comparison mode. Save load settings, ranking character creator. Uh, okay. Oh, we were in options. I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it. I got it. Setting up your veiled edges. As a swordsmith polishes a blade, so too does a blade smith sharpen the veiled edges of, in their charge. Choose a blade sharpening origin to determine the veil edges initial abilities. Okay. Killer. Breaker. I'll learn the art of nujitsu. Learn the way of the Veil Edge passed down for generations. Killer. Breaker. Learn the art of Nujitsu to complete highly dangerous missions. Training utilizes various equipment and can assassinate multiple enemies at once. Charismatic and charming. Efficient and practice movements allow efficient key usage. You can also be very clever with words to deceive people. Adept in hand handing firearms. Beginner. A novice of wide range of special skills at their disposal because of the unfinished nature. These vile edges are fear of full of possibility and more than others are capable of learning a multitude of special skills. That said, their lack of specialization may hold them back. A weakling. Okay, so this is Waste of Skin. I see. So we can see what's happening with our so killer 78 strength, dex int and charisma, breaker dex, a little more dex than everything else. Charisma for seducer, sapper is int, and beginner is all 75s. Why would I do all 75s when each one of these has at least 75 and then more. Interesting. It doesn't it doesn't necessarily say a level, so I can't you know how when you pick waste of skin, you uh in and um what is it? Dark Souls 3? No? Bloodborne? No. Shit, I don't remember. Anyway, you pick waste of skin. I think it's Dark Souls 3. And you end up with 10s and level 4, I think, or something. Maybe might be a Bloodborne. So you're 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 and then if you pick, say, a warrior, just making something up. You don't start out at level 4, you start at level 10, and then some stats are are used. But this doesn't say anything about levels. Obtain special skills, repel arrows, rapid assassinations, liar, refill, nothing for beginner. Well, we know we're not doing these two. So we want to do refill medicinal pills, sapper? No. Seducer, uh, this this is, seems kind of intriguing to me, but uh, rapid assassination or repel arrows, rapid assassination. That's me. That's my Chiquita.
the models in these games now. Oh my god. They're so detailed. Select character. What does that mean? Follow me. So I am... Whoa, 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 whoa. So there's a punch, watch, punch. That is square. But if I hold square, wait, if I hold square, do up. If I hit triangle, triangle, I do an uppercut right away. Dodge is circle, jump, right bumper, nothing, left bumper. That's left bumper, man. Right, right trigger. Um, okay. Wild Edge Village. Oh, look at the grass. So good. Wait, what's this? Touch the thing? Is that what it said? Wild Edge Village. Head to the Bladesmith's location and undergo battle training. Okay. Interacting with Vile Edge Banner will restore your health as well as replenish your medical pills and projectiles. Just be warned that it will cause a defeated enemy to reappear. Old dog. Okay. Standard. Okay. L3 is crouch. Let's run. Run the same as Bloodborne at circle. Hmm. Thought maybe there'd be something in here for me. And then this is on the side, around the outside, around the outside. Pretty strong, man. I'm coming. I'm coming. Okay. What are you going to use? Select weapon. The two weapons you choose here will be your initial weapons. The weapon best suited to you is determined by something that I can't say fast enough. Breaker excels in dexterity. Recommended weapons: paired swords. Uh, select polearm. Slick katana, slick spear, paired swords, odachi. You still not done yet. What's a odachi? Well, we, we want our a katana. It's best to go with something that suits you. Normal attacks. Square advance attacking is forward and square. Charge attack is hold square. Press again to unleash a barrage of attacks. Okay. Switch primary weapon is R1 and up. Switch primary weapon is R1 and How do you do like heavy attacks? Wait, okay, normal attack. 
that, charge, hold this, and lock on this R3. Nice, okay, so uh, let's switch. Two-handed, huh? Normal attack. A advancing attack is this. Wait, I do a stab? Okay, so charge attack is hold and I do this twirl thing. Okay, that's block. Standard. All right. You're happy with that then? He's my blade twin. All right, let's go. I didn't mean to pick the check, but you know, I. Sheath unsheath. R1 and R3. R1 and R3. Okay. What? What? What are you? What are you doing, dude? Training or not, I won't pull my punches. Take care of it. Press up, left, down, right to use an item registered. Okay. So we don't we don't need to you coming or what? Oh grapple rope, R2, okay. Coming. Listen, you don't have to be like all like that, right? Can't open that. Mm -hmm. Mar okay. Merida skills. Uh, use key to unleash a powerful attack. Hold R one. Okay. Right. Let's rimba up, shall we? What's in here? Nothing. Can I get into here yet? No. All right. 
So we got that. We have this. That's a marital thing. Spirit. Or sprint. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. Spirit does not. Okay, good. Like a Sekiro? We're here. Okay. So this is our first boss battle. Oh hey. Time to begin. Blintsmith. Cross swords and show me all you've learned. I haven't learned anything yet, dudes. I'll get the better of you this time. Hunter Spark. Use a counter spark to deflect and neutralize enemy attacks. Deflecting attacks with counter sparks will cause enemies to become temporarily panicked, opening a window of opportunity for you to do major damage. Counter spark is triangle. They counter spark them. Use the counter spark. Carry the blade to stun your enemy. I have to use the counter spark. I just did, didn't I? Hitting them? Have you forgotten? See us the moment. Counter spark in time with enemy attack. So he need so he needs to attack in order for me to counter spark? Do I need to do that? Not there. Hmm. Too early? Too early. Counter Spark Chains. You can deflect the repeated attacks with an enemy combo using Counter Sparks. But no, but please note, they're so polite. Deflecting one attack in a combo will not cause an enemy to become panicked. So rather than focusing on deflecting everything, it may be best to block. Counter Spark with a combo attack. All right, 
Let's do it again. Not bad. That was a bad one. Two. Hmm? Too fast. The best way to drain an enemy key is to first reduce their maximum key, panic enemies with counter sparks, and then attack to significantly reduce their maximum key. Okay. In such a situation, the use of the marital skill will prove more effective than normal. Okay. So, I know your every move. You'll have to do better. When an enemy stance has been broken, uh, once an enemy has been incapacitated and an icon turns red, you will be able to execute a critical hit. What am I doing? Hold that to You've improved. Yes, you did well. Well, wow. okay. There's Next, a lot there, you guys. Fight me. I will face the both of you. This is a lot, man. See. Jesus. Right, wait. In the veiled edge, two are one. Show me how well you've been before. You can switch control between either Veiled Edge member at any time. Left trigger and up. Oh. That's cool. How it feels for two to work has worked. I think I wasted that one. Ugh! <laughs> 
Enough training for now. I'm hmm. assigning you a new mission. The black ships from America are anchored off the coast at Yokohama. Sneak aboard and steal the secret message in Commodore Perry's possession. And okay. if the opportunity arises, kill Perry. Understood. You dare question your master? Oh, wait. Well, if you insist. The Shogunate has made a deal with the Americans. That is reason enough for us to strike. Okay. This is the day our clan has long prepared for. We can do we it. We finally go to war with the Tokugawa. Tokugawa. This is an order. Failure is not an option. We got it. Are you ready to head for the black ships? Yeah, what, what am I going to do? It's not just yet do. Yes. Um... Good. I know you will not let me down. Now move. Don't let me down. No, 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 no. We leave the boat here. My cigar, oh, there's a looker, man. It's a cutie. Alright, so we need to get aboard the boat and possibly kill this dude. Okay. So, triangle is essentially um, deflect. No, parry. Select character. She seems to be a lighter on her feet. Let's begin. What's this do? Warp? Is this Star Trek? Equipment. Menu screen. Weapons, armor, and accessories are equipped using specific slots. Um, the middle button equip presets, save or load equipment and combat style com combinations. Inventory, view the items in your possession status, okay. Uh, L2 for details on the start, okay. And the stat amplitude, stat aptitude, not amp, there's no M there. Base stats, total bonus. Attack 24. Attack 27. Oh, I got an Uchinata. A combat style with highly versatile techniques. Okay. 
uh, hold X to expend skill points and acquire special skills. Learn special skills a certain number of times will improve the corresponding stat. Cool. I don't have any skill points. You can view information in combat styles from the menu combat styles. Press square to view combat styles. Okay. Fair enough. Encyclopedia, yep. Alright. I thought I just died. I didn't. I didn't just die. Fast swim is O. Lock on is R3. Switch target is R. Locking on the camera and I don't make fighting them easier. Take one of them out. Leave the other two. Wait, what just happened? Uh, oh, how do I go up? Dive ascend is X. This little boat is kind of dumb. Not gonna lie. What just happened? Did I die? That guy died. I guess I died. I think what happened is my Chiquita fell in the water and I didn't know which button made it go up. We'll try that again. And also, um, Take one of them out, leave the other two. Assassinate, come up from underwater, approach an enemy without being noticed in the <laughs> Being noticed. Like, I was supposed to jump out of there and then he wasn't supposed to. See me somehow, and then I was gonna assassinate him. Okay, now what? Dudes, we are back. Just got some food, and I'm back. Okay. So we need to figure out what we need to do. Okay, so we can do that. So. Enemy types. Different enemy types can be identified by different overhead icons. A little down arrow is a normal enemy, or one mark. And then multiple is a formidable foe. Some formidable foes function as a leader for their group. After you have taken out the leader, they will no longer reappear when you interact with the banner. Ah, nice. 
Bring it on. Oh shit. Prepare yourself. <laughs> Okay. So we were we needed to act wait. We need to actually um like sneak up on that dude and we did a very poor job of sneaking up on that dude. So how can we sneak like this? Okay. So we should probably be doing that more than we are. Oh my god, raise a banner? Do I get shit? So if I touch the banner, will I... Infiltrating... Wait, I gotta write this down for our... Our, um, our descriptions. Infiltrating the black ship. Okay. So one of the dudes should be alive? No, I guess not. Well, I am glad for that. So how do we... Okay. So is there a way to the enemies, like enemy scent or something? Let's jump. Let's dodge. So now. So we need to go. <clears throat> Excuse me. So we need to go. Let's see. What's over here? Nothing. Right, that's a dude, like a, like a important dude. Assassinating enemies. Enemies will notice you and attack if they hear you. Crouch, walk lightly. This will allow you to move silently. Approach an enemy without being noticed and press the triangle. Okay. Approach from the back. Take it slow. War the practice has paid off. Oh my god, there's another dude like right there. There's this dude here. He's just a regular dude. So he he's facing oh okay. So this is all sort of tutorial-ish, right? Just have to see how our um, how fast we can run. before we get detected.
So we're on the other side now? Yeah. There's a dude, he's facing us. So that's not good. Well, how do we get through that without him noticing? Adding affinities, deflecting an enemy's gunfire and other such attacks and a well-timed counter spark will temporarily set your weapon ablaze. But why would we do that when they're just gonna come over here? They're not gonna come over here? Uh, can I go all the way over here? Yeah, so they just saw me and they're not going to. So what's run again? This is run? Okay. Oh, I got a rifle. Our noisy but an powerful attacks at range. Ready is L2 and shoot is R2. Okay. Looks pretty busy. Is there another way? Yeah. And we got another medical pill. And there's no way through there. Oh, hold on. So he's a regular dude, he's a regular dude, and he's a regular dude. And they can. They can't see us behind the things. Oh. I'm not quite sure how this is going to work. the banner bitches Ooh. that's good so let's see let's see what's this way Oh yeah, those will blow up. So when they go over there, I should blow up that thing. Didn't really work. Use a grappling rope in battle. You can use a grappling rope as a weapon. Also, certain objects like ex explosive barrels can be thrown at enemies. Oh, well, shit. Throw grappling rope at enemies. R2. Use grappling rope to throw objects at enemies. Hold R2 while that is displayed. Okay. 
Black ships all key. Um, how do I? here can't go through there is there a note here no Chest. Equipping weapons. Select equipment from the menu. Switch primary weapon. Okay. What's that? So we have the Uchinata. And we can use a saber. 33 damage instead of the Uchinata. So how do we do that again? So, can we jump up here? No. All right, so we got a new weapon and that was probably all scripted. So now we can head back to where we were. The big boat, man. Uh oh. Some dude saw me. Oh. We got a different gun? Oh my god. That's even more damage. a dude there. He's got a gun.
All right, let's look over here. Not see anything. I like the saber. Okay, wait, no. There and a way through there. Like a bedroom. There's a dude there. No soulsy type of thing going on here. Healing elixirs, too. Now, I don't know what that does, but it sounds like it would probably do more healing. Okay, so if we go... Oh, shit. What's this? Nothing. Raise the banner, bitches. We can't open this, right? Oh my god, we might be able to. Let's not do that yet. Let's go this way. There's a dude. There's dudes over there. Prepare yourself. Oh, shit. Yeah. That wasn't so good. Okay. Weren't we here? Didn't we get this? Yeah, 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 yeah. So we, so we, we went. That's going back. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. So we went this way, and then there's another. Wait, are we going the wrong way? I think we're going the wrong way. We killed all these dudes. We got that, and then let's go up here real quick and then look. It's like we could open up, we could open up that door.
right, we were here. Okay, and then we kill those dudes. Right, 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 right. Okay. Which we, I guess we didn't really need to do, but that's fine. Infiltrating the black ship, find Commodore Perry. Obtain the Perry report. Now, where is that stuff located? Healing elixir consumes to restore health and all your depleted key. That sounds good. I probably should quick slot that. Uh, is there a way to quick slot it? Use back options. No. Well, there must be a different way to add it. Type, here it is. A report written by the captain of the black ships. Intended for the US government's government. Uh, though at face value, it describes what method of hunting a monstrous whale on closer inspection reveals Perry has attended covert meetings with the upper echelons of the Shug Shugunet with the aim of opening Japan, uh, Japan's borders at goal, numerous parties had been working towards for many years without success. We got the hold key and a grappling rope. Okay. So that's what she wanted us to do. Now she wants us to kill Perry. Japan, the great white whale that's eluded all others. But my vision is clear, and my harpoon ready. Huh? <laughs> Enemy marital skills. To avoid marital skills of enemies enveloped by a murderous red aura, you'll have to rely on a perfectly timed counter spark. There are enemy marital skills which are very tricky to deflect with counter spark. Some cannot be blocked by guarding. For this reason, dodging can sometimes be more effective. Okay. Like, like right there. Oh, that was not a good one then. 
my equipment now how do we how do we put this how do we put that in our skill slot Equipment armor wait for items. Here it is. Nice. I need help. Doing the same thing. Okay, I need to make a better um, Okay, so oh no It takes all my shit away. <laughs> oh man. I Didn't know this was here Black and silver saber Does more damage. We'll take it. Uh. 
All right, well, um, this is not going to be good. Wrong button for the deflect. Well, that's not good. What? Live and take the secret message. What? What does that mean? Truly a pity. 
beautiful sight. Was that planned? Was that... That was... What's that supposed to happen? What's that supposed to happen? That was the only trace that remained. So we not only got what you wanted, we also killed the dude. So she should be happy. She should, she's not happy. The two of us are one. Don't forget this. Well, I can just see some... I can see some pretty crazy... Um, Sekiro shit coming on, man. The setting sun... Gotta write that down for my... Who's that? Oh, okay, this is just a... Did we get anything from that fucking battle besides, like, getting my dude killed? No. Armor. We're wearing that, we're wearing those. All right, no. So, he's in there, that dude. And, does he come out? Shrimpkin can be thrown quickly and consecutively. Throw with L2. Blade Flash. R1 immediately after attack. Shake off blood stains for replenish key. Each attack with your primary weapon increases the amount of blood on it. Shake off blood stains from. Oh, what? What is going on here? How many fucking dudes are there? I dodge that shit. Do I get anything from this? These dudes don't drop anything. Did 
Dude. I'm I'm gonna need help here, man. I need to figure out what the hell is going on. What is that? Wait, what what kind of attack is that? Where do I see that? I have shrunkens. I can fire them with an L2. I have ten. Okay. Oh, that's the that's my deflect. Excuse me. Two hundred meters. I have one health pot. Hope I can find more. The hell is that something? That. I guess maybe I can't dodge it, that's the point. Jesus. So we're gonna want a skill that um gives us life back? Oh shit. Your clan is doomed. Oh I got a I got a fox. Thank god. Do any of these other dudes have pots? Yep. We're gonna destroy all the shit in her pots, man. That's that, and then they all come back to life. We're not doing that. What's in here? Nothing? Looking around is a good idea. Not that that's really going to make that much difference, but it might.
Yeah, 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 yeah. I am aware of that. Assassinate from high up. You can also assassinate enemies by approaching them from above. That's a pod, that's good. Another shrimpkin, which I haven't used yet. I guess I probably should use those at some point. Crouching in tall grass makes you harder to, to detect. Can't go up there. Can I go up there? No. So it's a hundred meters that way is the lady. The bladesmith. So this is this is a lot like souls where you're constantly trying to target something. Is there a different way that I can go? I don't believe I can go in the water, can I? Hey, dude. We're gonna dive down and see if we can find some stuff under here. Because this looks pretty good. 
So why don't we get out before we die? Abandon the clan and search for them. They are still alive. I have to. Have you forgotten the code? Same side. You know I cannot let you leave. Right. Deserters of the clan are marked for death. Come now. Have you forgotten who the master is? What was that? You weren't doing that before. I'm not, I died. Wait, I have to kill all these dudes again? I need your help. Yeah, I'm not gonna help you. Oh, bitch. I mean, why would I help her? Shogunate has found us. This is the end. Okay, great. <laughs> Sick. 
her because she's hard. She's she's not probably hard, but I was trying to so when we fought her, I was trying to do this to when she was shooting at me, but I'm not sure if she's shooting at me. I don't know when I have to do that. She's gonna shoot that. So, what is this? Okay, let's try it again. I don't, I don't see that. I, don't, I just don't see it. There it is. Okay, I know now. Come now. Have you forgotten who the master is? I got it now. Do it again. Do it again, Bladesmith. How will you fight with those things? Show me all you've got! Not bad. So, do it again, do it again, do it again, do it again. Yeah. You're toast. Do it again, do it again, do it again. I'm just gonna circle, you can throw that, that'll miss me. Jump up and do it. Ready? Go. Ready? Go. Oh yeah. Let's see what he got. Alright, you got that. That's fine. What else do you have? Hmm? Bye. Yeah, let's be... But, oh my god. I can't believe you're dying. Oh, I can't believe it, even though I killed him. Oh. Can't finish the job. You always were soft. She pulls a dagger out and stabs me, kills me, game over. You've been the same ever since I took you in. Now I am the master. Once I was a learner. Ever since I lost my blade twin, I've had to live with the pain of surviving. The dogs are going to eat her.
God. That was the prologue. Flying the nest. You obtained a material. You use materials at apothecaries to craft remedies, stones, and other status and status altering ailments. Blacksmiths are where you can upgrade equipment, transfer special effects. Materials can be harvested from plants, minerals, okay. My god. Dude. That's new save data. I can have multiple save files. Alright guys. That was a longer than expected episode. That was mm -hmm. one hour and 45 minutes, but that was the beginning. We did, we went through the prologue, the entire prologue. We died a few times, but we sort of figured it out a little bit. And man, I think, I think if, if we can, I mean, it's just like any, any game that has that that uh, parry ability. If we can parry, man. The parry window looks pretty good. So, I mean, like, seriously, I'm still level one after all that shit. Okay, there's a problem. All right, guys. Hope you enjoyed this. Please subscribe. See you soon.